and I got into media ministry because of um, Apostle uh, Ken Simpson's uh, guidance over the years. I hadn't even met him until now, and um, I had a friend who uh, was part of a group called Intercessors for Israel who knew about Ken Simpson's ministry, from, um, this prophet from Texas, and she was telling me how his ministry works. You know, you send, you send him um, a donation, and he'll give you the word of the day. Uh, needless to say, I had to, I had to um, really pray about it because I, I was still a babe in the prophetic. So I knew I'm like, well, I heard so many different things about money, you know, sending money and for the prophetic word, and maybe that might not be of God. But I, I stood out in faith because I, I saw how it blessed my friend and others, and so I just gave um, him very little, and I couldn't believe how exact. Um, um, Kent was in his um, prophetic deliverance. It was a word that I needed on time. I was going through the transition with my family as a single parent um, when my kids were little, and he gave me this very specific word that I that God just used to carry me through until now. And then there was a few others, and um, after that, and um, one of them was when my husband, who I'm married to now, God blessed me with. It was a word, a prophetic word, in 2002 that the Lord was going to um, send someone my way uh, that was going to ask my hand in marriage. I had known this man for years, but it, the Lord did not remove the veil until after that prophetic word was delivered. Uh, the Lord gave me a, 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 a divine imprint uh, when I was talking to someone else who was actually interested in, in my hand for marriage. but was kind of skirted and he was in ministry and I'm like I don't think you're the one God gave me the date of August 6 2002 that that was going to be the time that I was going to be asked you know to, be, to marry this, the person that God had for me and it was going to be at three o'clock divine mercy hour right and so what happened was um, when my husband who I known as an acquaintance for years as a prayer partner Jeff um, when he had um, asked my hand in marriage we were at K Jewelers and um, uh, he got down on his knees and asked my hand in marriage, and I had to ask the jewelers, because I, I don't wear watches at the time. Um, I asked what time it was, and they said 3 o'clock, and I said, what day? August 6th, I said, okay, I'm going to marry you, because it was I knew it was the Lord's divine timing for this. And the prophetic word that um, Apostle Kent had for me was that, that there was going to be um, an announcement of this um, before all in the fall and before all is my husband's big family he comes from a family of 10 and then they have grandchildren and the whole house went for whenever there's holidays it's like over 30 people in went this one house um, now it's it's increased but very big family and that was the before all and we had gotten married February 14 2003 and it was just awesome you know so God God knows, you know, where, who you are, where you live, what your name is. But I really believe that coming under this man's ministry and mantle, uh, especially if you have a, a, a prophetic calling to help others, all right, realize theirs. This is the place to be. PMT.